signed up for the concert when I was going to sing for it. Um, but between the, the try to keep it short and something that happened earlier this morning, I figured out which song I was going to do. Um, earlier this morning, I was in the hallway, and there was this very, very, very cute kid playing with a very red car that reminded me of my nephew, which reminded me of this song that I learned at Penzik a couple years ago from one of my campmates in McGuire's Marauders, uh, Jeff Suzuki. Uh, this song is called The SCA Grove, and he goes on to say that some of these are based off my fear of legends, except he had heard them directly from the people he's happened to, and some of these other things are autobiographical. <laughs> the SCA Grove. When I was a young lad, I joined recreators who cherished the past and loved learning its ways. I met my dear wife there, and soon we had children, a boy and a girl who now read school age. In open house season, we went to their classroom, but all of the parents and staff tried to hide. I asked, what's the problem? And that's when their teacher took me by the hand and then led me aside. She said, I'm accustomed to watching their antics at recess. Their cries of lay on are quite cute. And if they use words such as defenestration or call the sky azure, it's really a hoot. Your children are joys and I'm happy to teach them. They're quite well behaved and so eager to learn. Believe me, I know that this really is awkward, but there are a few things that cause us concern. They say that their mother's a mistress to someone, and you help the king to kill many a man. They say that their spelling is good for old English, and their uncle's a master of some southern clan. At craft time, they made up a working contraction. I called it a catapult, which made them laugh. <laughs> Good sir, will you tell me what cult you're a part of? Should I call the cops or the counseling staff? <laughs> I smiled and I told her, there's a good explanation. I sat down and told her of the SCA. We're regular people who've got some odd interests, like brewing and dancing the whole night away. And now there's no problem, for she's joined our canton. There she's working away on a high tutor count. Her class now does chain mail, and she started fencing, and she's got the principal fighting in crown. <laughs> so 